The student wants to emphasize the fossil significance. Which choice most effectively uses relevant information from the notes to accomplish this goal? While researching a topic, a student has taken the following notes. Pinnipeds, which include seals, sea lions, and walruses, live in and around water. Pinnipeds are descended not from sea animals, but from four-legged land-dwelling carnivores. Canadian paleobiologist Natalia Rysbinski recently found a fossil with four legs, webbed toes, and the skull and teeth of a seal. Rysbinski refers to her rare find as a transitional fossil. The fossil illustrates an early stage in the evolution of pinnipeds from their land-dwelling ancestors. So choice A says, Canadian paleobiologist Natalia Rysbinski's fossil has the skull and teeth of a seal, which, like sea lions and walruses, is a pinniped. This is incorrect because this does not emphasize the fossil's significance, it nearly describes the fossil's characteristics. So A is incorrect. B. Pinnipeds are descended from four-legged land-dwelling carnivores, a fossil that resembles both was recently found. This is incorrect for the same reason as A, because it does not emphasize the fossil significance, it merely describes pinnipeds ancestry and shows how a fossil connects uh, the pinnipeds to their ancestors. So B is incorrect. C. Having four legs but the skull and teeth of a seal, the rail fossil illustrates an early stage in the evolution of pinnipeds from their land-dwelling ancestors. This seems to be correct because this emphasizes the fossil significance, which is that it represents the early, an early stage in the evolution of pinnipeds from their land-dwelling ancestors. So C seems to be the correct answer. D. A transitional fossil was recently found by paleobiologist Natalia Rysbinski. This is incorrect because it does not emphasize the fossil significance. It nearly describes the fossil as being a transitional fossil. So D is incorrect, and the correct answer is C.